online and on your smart speaker. My Beauty Spot, fragrance kiosk at Cannes Central, powered by Chemist Warehouse. Hit News Briefing. Hi there, it's Amanda Myler with the latest. It's a wild day on the weather front. There is a heatwave warning out for Victoria, South Australia, WA, New South Wales and Tassie today, with temps rising across some parts into the early 40s. Adelaide is to sweat through its ninth straight day above 30 degrees. The Bureau of Meteorology, Dean Narrimore, says a weak change will bring some relief to southern parts of Victoria and South Australia tomorrow. But the heat will return on Monday and Tuesday, with many areas likely to go back up into the high 30s or low 40s as we move into Monday and Tuesday through southeastern parts of the country, and temperatures in the low to mid 30s through Tasmania. North Queensland is copping intense rain with isolated 24-hour falls in excess of 400 mils possible. There is a severe weather warning out for heavy rainfall about the coast between Cardwell and Camilla and inland of those areas. Multiple roads are closed or impacted already by flood waters with a major highway shut both ways north of Mackay. New South Wales Labor leader Chris Minns reckons Premier Dominic Perrottet's Nazi uniform decision was a massive mistake but hasn't gone as far as demanding he resign. Perrottet has apologised over wearing a Nazi uniform to his 21st birthday party back in 2003. Meantime, the Prime Minister has gotten straight back to work after touching down from his historic tour of PNG. Anthony Albanese is spending the morning in Townsville, committing $70 million to build a hydrogen hub. Beyond Blue is here to help you achieve your best possible mental health. For more information, advice and support, visit beyondblue.org.au today. Nick Kyrgios has again flagged his retirement plan, saying if he wins a Grand Slam, he's done. He came up in a convo on court after last night's Oz Open charity exhibition match against Novak Djokovic, which Team Kyrgios won. Uh, I think you said late last year you'd retire if you won one. True? 100%. Um, I, it's a lot of training, it's a lot of work, and I just want to be able to eat whatever I want, drink what I want to drink. <laughs> Continuing for Cairns, getting to a low of 24 degrees tonight. Another wet one tomorrow with a possible storm. It's the daily stories that matter in under 20 minutes. Just search the briefing podcast on Listener, download the app now and listen for free.